Bonjour, it is me, Queen Cotalia, and this is how to who do hijan the conqueror, who he is, what he is, and how he can assist you. We will also bring our attention to those that want to participate in the Haijan Community Service held November 17th, 2021. This is going to be an incredible video. Commençons. Bonjour. Comment ça va? Je suis Cotalia Benson Milner Mendoz de la Ponte, le Rano du de la Co Aperial Milner Mendoz de la Ponte. I am Queen Cotalia, the Hoodoo Queen of the Imperial Court Milner Mendoz de la Ponte, owner of Comedos Conjure, the creators and founders of the annual Hoodoo Queen Conjure Fact. The proud owners of Conjure South, ConjureSouth.com, Conjure South Publications, and the Conjure South Hoodoo Institute of Traditional African American Conjure, Roots Work, and Divination. Bienvenue, son mon cher, et bienvenue et Conjure South. Welcome, welcome, welcome. In this video today, we're going to be discussing Haijan the African-American folk spirit. We are going to also delve into the roots, how they work, the oils, the community service, and much more. But before we get into that, you know what I need for you to do. Hit that subscribe button. Give this video a thumbs up. Leave a sweet, kind comment below. Hit your notification button as well as share the video. So let's begin. So again, as you all know, that this up and coming month is the Haijan Community Service. And a lot of you are like, Queen, I have my Haijan root from last year. What do I do with it? How do I work with this? I thought that I could da 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 Well, here we go. Let's get into it. First and foremost, who is Haijan? All right. Um, but before I get into who is Haijan, let me explain to you this part about the community service, all right? Last year, we accumulated over $400,000 for you, the community. Every year, Haijan is just blessing more and more and more. Almost like 100000 more every year to the community. Not to me, I wish, but no. Um, but I am so excited because he made his appearance very clear in October saying, I'm going to come. And then he literally shows up and I'm still picking out some roots um, for this community service. And um, I actually have to go out of town this weekend to my hometown to grab um, more Harvest Haijan roots from my great aunt and uncle. So I will be um, getting them from my great aunt and uncle this weekend and all of that jazz. But I do know how it's so, so, so important for you all to know what you're doing, who you're working with, how it works and all of those things. But I want to also communicate before we get deep into this video is there are a limited supply of roots and oils. So as you all know, Haijan told me, Queen, if you, um, I will work for them beyond, you know, measure, beyond what I've done before in the past, but you have to give to them. So I decided to go $20 less, number one, as well as provide you with two hygiene items instead of one. One of those items are actual roots directly from um, my front yard, <laughs> okay, as well as roots from my family's property. And then um, you're getting Haijan oil. Your oil that you are receiving is the literal essence of the root, the exact root that you're going to be receiving. Now, I also want to just show you all this because a lot of times people get really caught up with, oh my gosh, well, this is so small and da 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 We have this size Haijan. This is all on the same route now, the same circuit, four different sizes, four different bulbs of hygiene. So you can, and that was, I think a little one starting, I think, no, that's just the leaf. Yeah, so 
These are different sizes that I wanted to show you in that they're coming directly from the, 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 the property. So anyways, with that being said, it is really important for you to, um, one, let me make this clear. When we run out of roots, you, the option of having roots and oil will not will no longer be a thing, okay? I will know the total of roots um, after this weekend. Half of the roots that I showed you earlier from, you know, the, the last um, Zodiac readings, half of these are already gone. I think more than half of these are already gone. So there's that. So the link is below. If you want to join the Hyjian Community Service, um, there will be, and once we run out of roots, I may just do oils alone, but you won't get a root, but we'll see. Um, but I will say they're not going to last. I mean, over half of these are already gone and it's only been, what, two days, three days now? So anyways, let's get into this with Haijan. So who is Haijan? Haijan is an African-American folk spirit, Okay. An African-American folk spirit. This means that this was an ancestral spirit whose blood, sweat, determination, work was consecrated into these particular roots. Folk spirits like Hyjan are not your herbal allies, your conjuring herbal allies. This is not like hyssop or rosemary or nutmeg or bay leaf. No, this is an actual individual whose essence consecrated these particular plants. All right? So that's number one. Now, what does he do? Who, you know, all of those things. Well, Haijan um, was an ancestor that came over from the transatlantic slave route. All right? And... When people needed him, he came. There was nothing that stopped him. When there was work needing to be done or somebody needed to get away, he could do it. Nothing stopped him. He was very witty. He was very smart. He was that warrior, but he was he was that 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 like the soldier that was able to get through all of these things. Now, there's legends that say that he was a prince and all of those things, but I'm gonna be honest with you all. The majority of people that were enslaved were not princes, they were not royals, they were not kings and queens. In fact, they were farmers. And that's the truth. That is just the truth of the matter. That's why they were over here, whether it's with the rice plantations or tobacco plantations, etc. Because a lot of these plantations were things that you already knew, um, like the rice plantations and the people on the sea islands and the Gullah nations, etc. So, um, Haijan, um, being that he is an African-American folk spirit, um, carried a lot of these great, amazing characteristics. When I think of Haijan, I literally get um, Ogu and Ogun vibes. I say Ogu and Ogun because um, Ogu in Vodou is a house of Ogus and then Ogun in regards to Ifa because a promise is a promise. A vow is a vow. Whatever it is that needs to be done, he's going to make sure it's done. Nothing's going to stop him. And he knows how to get through, over, under, however it's going to be done. And so he provides that. So this is why the Haijan root is known to be that root of success and conquering. Conquer over things. in that space of success. And to succeed can be success in anything. It can be money, it can be love, it can be health. It can be a variety of those things, but it's conquering over things and succeeding because that's how and who he is. So with that being said, um, utilizing um, a space to have Haijan assist you. Let me say that again utilizing a space, not using Haijan, utilizing a space, creating a space where Haijan can assist you is incredibly important. Understand this, with Haijan, any herbal spirits, animal spirits, spirits of the dead, 
they do not have to work with you. They may not agree with you. And that is just that simple point blank period, complete stop. There's no um, reason to make y'all fantasize and think that you got the power to control a Loa or an Arisha. And you surely don't have the power to just control any um, herbal ally or folk spirit. It is about creating relationships and working with them and respecting them if they don't work with you. I really try to get y'all to like stop this whole cinnamon is money, cinnamon is money. No, the reason why that is always circulating is because people only know very little about these traditions for real. So it's just regurgitated because it's all they got. That's all they got. And, and the truth is a cinnamon may not be your friend, could very well be your frenemy, creating a hole in your pocket and your money is leaking. So it's very important to understand that there has to be a respect and relationship built with these things. Now, Haijan as a folk spirit is a folk spirit like um, Santa Murthy, okay? A folk spirit like um, La Dama. Um, and, and you have like a folk saints and folk spirits and so forth and so on. Um, and so this is, that he is one of those spaces. And if you read um, Bad Medicine, you will also hear about there are other types of spirits, like inherited spirits, which are tradition, which are folk spirits in particular lineages. And that is um, another thing and a completely different um, conversation to be had. So, um, yes, so there's that. Now, let's talk about, well, Queen, I've had my hygiene root from last year. What do I do with it? This new root is coming out. I've already done it. Do I need it? Let me tell you something about a folk spirit. Traditionally, you work with that spirit for like one thing and one time a year, which is why I do these annually. Okay? So what do I do with last year's mojo hand? You take that mojo hand, you can literally bear it at the crossroads, give your thanks and appreciation, and be done. Okay? Very easy, very simple. Um, you can give him to the water, let him wash away, but this is a, a spirit of the earth. So putting him back in the earth is ideal. All right? Um, so then... The next thing, well, this year you're going to get your root and your oil. Let me make this part very clear. Traditionally, this would not be called an oil. But because you don't know this and because um, this is like layman's terms, okay, I call it an oil so everyone can understand. But truly, this is an essence. This is the essence of hygiene. But I use the term oil because people aren't going to understand that. So when you're using the essence of a folk spirit, you literally have them in oil form. So you will be getting your hygiene root, which you can put in a bag at your home. You can ask him for whatever it is you need, etc. All right. And then you have the essence of hygiene, which you will have in a oil form, which you can say, you know, hygiene. Let's go on to this um, to this court case. Get me up out this thing. Put it in my shoes. We good to go. Okay, we got some of this hygiene essence. Let me go on to the casino and see what we got to do. All right, my baby, it's done, right? So that's what the essence does and provides. So it's very, very important for you to understand that there is a difference. So you can use, you can, um, Take Haijan, plant him at your home, place him at your home, and allow him to do his work for you and your home. And then you have the essence where you can carry him with you. So you have him in two places at all times. Okay? Excuse me, for me. Oui? Très bien. Um, après ça, um, we are then going to talk about the, um, the space of offerings. Okay? Um, used to, the old people would be on the porch when they needed hygiene. They would call them in the, in the morning. They would reach out to the east and they would sing or yell, hygiene, hygiene. 
and they were calm. All right, but they were hmm, 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 and that would be high John, high John, high John, and so that's the tune that they would hum in the mornings when they would speak to their high John. In the evenings, you would place out food, cornbread, greens, beans, um, corn, um, different types of vegetables. Meat was not a luxury for us. Um, so you put out food in the evening because he's worked all day for you. He's working all day for you, and you put out that food, you take that food, and you bury it in your front yard. And that's why Haijan continues to bless you. That's how you feed Haijan. So you have your root at your house, leave it at your house. Put it in a bag. It'll come in a little box or whatever. There's that. But then you take your essence with you, and you are able to ask him for that assistance in those spaces get you out of situation, a cop pull you over, sprinkling your shoes, you're going to get a warning, you won't get a ticket. You know, those kind of things um, he'll able to help get you out of. And again, he has already agreed to doing this. So you just got to be open to receiving your blessings. Every year, I always ask people to DM me, inbox me the money that you are receiving so that we can see how much He's going to bless the community this year. So again, um, right now, over half of these are sold. I'm going to my hometown this weekend to see um, how many more we have. I will put that limit at the, on, on my cart um, at, at, on, on the website. And once they are sold, I will only then do oils, but you won't be able to get your roots. So there's that. I thank you so very much for your energy, time, and effort, and um, I will see you all very soon. Merci beaucoup. Until next time, peace be soon.